Hey guys, welcome back. So right now I'm playing Assassin's Creed Rogue. I've never actually played any Assassin's Creed games before. This is my first one. I was watching trailers and also just how the game I was playing in. I thought it was interesting just going through the gameplay and everything. So I'm going to give you a breakdown of the game. So the game is basically set in the French and Indian War times in 19 in sorry in 1752 to 1760. So I end up playing Shea. So Shea is an Irish American assassin. He ends up basically leaving his brotherhood to join up with the Templars so they can actually take down his brotherhood. I like the story and just the energy of it because of how it goes. Let's get into Assassin's Creed Rogue. Let's head back. Come on. Have to deliver Andrea and his crew must run into some trouble. Who knew making the smugglers would lead to no good? I still don't understand why you can't tell me what we're doing here. Because Chevalier decided not to tell you. I thought we were friends, Liam. We are. But this is business. It doesn't concern you, Shay. Am I going too fast for you? I'll just keep an eye on you, in case you fall down and hurt yourself. Good catch. Hurry, oh, best not keep Chevalier waiting. Merde, où sont ces critères? The space, the... Where the hell were you two? We were out hunting. What happened here? My men were attacked by some English sea dogs. Why, Captain Joseph... Couldn't you fight them all off by yourself like you're always saying? It is Capitaine Louis-Joseph Gauthier, Chevalier de la Vérandrie. And you are dreaming if you think any training could make you into a proper assassin. Do you even know what that means? It means being responsible for an ancient and proud tradition. It means obeying your mentor without question. How else will we ensure freedom for the human race? Them's pretty words, Chevalier. But I don't feel too free at the moment. Well then, feel educated! Ugh. You irresponsible wretch! How dare you show me such disrespect! You simpleton! You rot-brained cabbage farmer! Gentlemen, stop! We got a common enemy, and I reckon he's close. The Royal Navy attack my vessel and force my men to flee. We are stranded, and what is worse, the smugglers we were supposed to meet have been taken prisoner. Shay and I are free, those smugglers. You, treat your wounded. Take these. You'll need them. Fred with Kersey. Royal Navy, be ready for us. Remember your train. Ready to teach them a lesson? They don't stand a chance. Where are your mates now, you filthy uh. rat? You up <laughs> before I bash out your brains! <laughs> Keep an eye out, lads! They're bound to out there somewhere! Aye, stop! 
He's mine! Thank you. Many thanks. I thought I'd be home. Happy hunting, lads. Pepper a blade. Super French vessel. You do a match for you. <laughs> yeah. Oh, come on, guns. I was saving those fellas for you. Very thoughtful. Maybe you were not completely useless, Sheik. Speaking of useless, those blockheads won't be needing this vessel anymore. This pile of mail? You want her, Shay? She is yours. Now bring me back to my ship. He's really, really rude. You heard, Chevalier? This vessel is yours, Shay. Go on. Take the wheel. Some of the men you rescued agreed to join us. They should prove a good crew. I'm not so certain about their captain, but next to me you're the most experienced sailor in the Federal trade. Besides, we could use another vessel, even this pitiful one. She's mine, ain't she? Aren't she? Your own pile of garbage, yes. Ah, with a lick of paint and a few new cannons, she'll look as fine as anything on the seven seas. Shall we begin, captain? Indeed, mate. Oh, come on now. Captain, it's a mess. But she's still afloat. Name's the Morgan. Morgan? That silly fairy queen who ruined Merlin, the wise? Oh, she's perfect for you, Shay. Morgan was an old goddess, the queen of war and darkness. She harvested the souls of fallen warriors. Perfect indeed. Holding cargo! Not coming up! Oh, A ship! She is a false shin! They will sink her! Let's put the Morrigan to the test, Captain Stay. Ready for battle, men! On your mark, Captain! Fire! Damn these eyes! Stop them, boy! Do something! Brace! Brace! All set! Fire! Yeah! My ship! Awaiting orders, sir! Ship! They're giving chase! It's a gunboat! Ships of the Royal Navy, sir! Stop, say! Are you daft? Ready here! Easy prey, Captain Fire. Norman! It seems this vessel is battle ready after all. I will return to what is left of Le Guerfou. 
It's a long way home, and we have repairs to do. Sing hearty, lads. Chevalier is pleased with us. I think I think I have no now we're good shows. ready to sail for the horn. We're all in the Our boots and our clothes boys are all in the horn. We're all again dandy dandy. What course would you have me set, Shay? Time to report back to the mentor. Wouldn't you agree? Wise words, Captain. Wise words. Sorry for the rough exit. Your piece working, check. This is not a you were just an anonymous. Anonymous, yes? You were using it to access a genetic memory file in Helix labeled Shea Cormac? You work for Upstergo Entertainment, remember? Any of this ringing a bell? Your session triggered something bad and it's affecting the whole building. We need to find your boss. You haven't forgotten your boss, have you? Melanie LeMay, sipper, chipper, overachiever? Here, take your communicator, check it if you get lost. Emergency. Now let's get out of here. Follow me, double time. This chaos is absolutely your fault, in case you're wondering. Everyone, just like we practice in our safety drills. Everything is going to be okay, guys. Stay. Repeat, this is not a test. What the hell is happening? A file labeled Shea Cormac was booby-trapped with some kind of virus. Your job is to prevent things like this. We need to contain these genetic memories, then we can destroy them. No, isolate them. I want to study these memories. But... With respect, Miss LeMay. This is not a request. You heard the man. Fine. I need to borrow your numbskull. That okay with you, Ms. LeMay? Emergency. Hey there, this might seem a bit weird, but you're going to work for contractors we hired to, you know, upgrade our security. Mr. Otto Berg and Ms. Violet DaCosta. Call me Violet. I have to go check on our people and prepare a statement for the press. Do whatever they tell you to do, okay? Go team! Technically, you're not responsible for this, but you're the one who let the virus out. So I think it's only fair you help me clean it up. Mr. Berg wants us to relive Shay's genetic memories. To do that, we need to access them from Helix. But the Helix is down. We'll have to reboot the main servers in the basement. Man, whoever designed this virus is a genius. Not only does it restrict our access to the cloud, it's adapted to fuck up the other operating systems that regulate building functions. Melanie, the elevators are out of commission. Are we stuck on this floor? on site ASAP. There's a working area server on this floor. I guess it'll have to do for now. Agent DaCosta, I want regular updates on your progress with Shay's genetic memories. Why? He's just a nobody's size, I can tell. If Shay Cormac is who I suspect he is, then this temporary setback may provide us with an unexpected reward. Proceed to the server room on this floor. Assassins would have you believe that Al Mualim was a great mentor who became corrupted with greed, and that he schemed with the Templars to acquire an apple of Eden. I see instead a shrewd and cunning leader, a man who used his best assassin, Al Ta'ir ibn Lahad, to eliminate his conspirators in order to keep the apple for himself, so that he could use it to enforce world peace. While it must be stated unequivocally that Al Mualim was not a Templar. It is interesting to me 
that his vision of peace was more in line with Templar philosophy than assassin. In the past, both sides had the same goal, that of peace. Our only difference was how we chose to achieve it. Had Al-Mualim not been killed by Altair and allowed to carry out his plan, perhaps we would not be fighting now. It was only after Altair reformed the Brotherhood with its new ideals of free will that the conflict truly escalated and spread across the planet. For if the so-called wise man of the mountain can see things from our point of view, surely the same can be said for other assassins. You know what authorized personnel only means, don't you? It has been a long time. Achilles. Adewale. How go things in the West Indies? Very poorly, I'm afraid. Your countenance tells me we should discuss this. Come. Who's our visitor? That's Adewale. Who's a slave or freed himself. And hundreds of his brothers in the West Indies. That man's a living incarnation of the creed. I see. You join me for some practice? Soon. I've got uh, other business first. Tell me what happened, old friend. It was terrible, Achilles. <laughs> Aren't you supposed to be training? The woman looked worried earlier. I heard that Liam's waiting for you. Seen him yet? I hear Mistress Hope was looking for you. You are late. Oh, what did I miss? Only the first hour of training. We're always training, Kasegawase, and will continue to do so. Do not waste your words. Shea abhors improvement as much as cats abhor leashes. Hey. A pity. The boy has so much potential. But so little discipline. All right. All right. What would you have me do? Well played. So, what's the challenge today? Shooting straight and true. Here, you can use these. These are yours. Well, I want you to have half a chance of succeeding. Go on. Shoot these targets. You can take your time, but not too much. We've more work after this. Hmm. 
Reload. Anyone can hit targets standing still. Let's see how you do on the run. Come on, hurry up. Come on, hurry up! Well done, Shay. Keep it up. It'd be kind of cool if you could. You're doing all right, Shay. But don't let the others vex you. They mean well, though they'll never show it. If you could like run and shoot at the same time, run, then you have to slow down. It's about time you showed up. Far be it for me to keep a lady waiting. I'm no lady here. And don't you forget it. I'm your teacher. And you're better. Well, some of that is true at least. What are we be doing? Exploring a myriad ways to end a life. You two! Make yourselves useful and watch Shay. Can you kill without being noticed? Nicely done. I am surprised. Take the high ground, Shane. Dispatching from the air is most effective. You certainly know how to handle yourself. Stay low and stick to the ground. Be patient and you might hit your target. Nothing can interest you here. Go away. Top four, Shay. You did better than I expected. Have your skills actually grown, Shay? <laughs> Do not get a swelled head over it. Shay, follow me. It's time you learn to survive in the frontier. I think I've been managing well enough so far. Perhaps. But there is more I can teach you. Time for the hunt. Okay. Use all your senses together to find prey. Killing should not be meaningless. We must use what nature gives us. Good. Now to use what you have taken from nature. With these, you can keep your pistols close. Achilles has one more thing to show you. Remember what I taught you.
Shay, I hear you've become quite the marksman. Generous gift. Thank you, Venter. My ship awaits, Achilles. The people of Haiti will make good use of your supplies. I trust you will retrieve what has been lost. Lost? The Templars stole two precious artifacts. A manuscript of ancient wisdom and a box that allows one to understand its language. I have tracked the Templar as far as his coast, but I fear the rest is up to you, my friend. Farewell, Adewale. Whoever controls the artifacts can access precursor sites of power. We must recover them, or none are safe. That's not so bad for like the first time. Where to? Wherever Templar affairs lead us. Liam, it's not like you to set out without a plan. A plan or no plan. We choose our own battlefield. And hey, we're not most at ease when we're at sea. Right you are. Let's set sail. Now don't ever get sail. We only have one lead, Shay. Let's hope it brings us closer to the artifacts. Sir Keely starts you with this mission? No. He tasked me to task you. We need to find what was stolen from Mackendall Shade. You have to recover the precursor box of manuscript. This is your mission. And what's yours? To watch your arse. Achilles doesn't really trust me, does he? Give it time, Shay. Do this for him. For us. Do much more than earn his trust. Ma'am, do you know what Achilles writes about? I see him in his office all the time. Back over his papers. He keeps records and accounts. Studies what little is known about the beasts of Eden. And of course, it corresponds with assassins on other continents. Of course? Ma'am, you are going to be a right horse's arse when it comes to assuming everyone knows the same as you. I cannot help but Achilles wants me to be familiar with their counterparts in Europe and elsewhere. He said like his favourite son. Connor's his favourite and only son. And Achilles is there. Connor may inherit the house, but you'll be mentor. We'll see. Whatever you say, Prince Regent of the Assassins. If you call me that again, I'll throw you in the ocean. Trust me, you will sell those lobster by the ton in France. Ah, the cabbage farmer has returned. About time. We have a lead on that curious manuscript. I'd be surprised if you can read it. No one can read it, imbecile. This is why the Templar are taking so long with it. But one of our allies has caught a glimpse of their work. A pirate? A spy who worked with the pirate. We set sail for Anticosti. That should prove a good test for this floating cesspit you call a ship. He clearly does not like us. How trustworthy are the pirates? I consider them brothers, Shay. When the time comes, they will invade and help us fight the Templars. If only there was beef would realize the Templars were pulling their strings. Are the Templars truly in control in the colonies? Not quite, but their influence reaches far and wide. And what about the spy we You need not worry about your chasseur. He is loyal to the Brotherhood. As it happens, he also has friends in both the French and the English fleets. And he knows more about what... I, I had the honor of working with him once. I've never known anyone who done so much for our cause. It's much more than that. Adi Wale was already disarmed before joining the Brotherhood. He was a pirate. The scourge of the West Indies. Rubbing elbows with the likes of Blackbeard, Woods Rogers, and Calico Jack Racker. Calico who? Oh, read a book, will you? About 20 years ago, and while he intercepted a Templar convoy and stole a mysterious package, he traveled to Porto Prince and entrusted it to a woman he believed was loyal to our cause. That's me, guess. She wasn't. Oh, she was, very much so. The package eventually found its way to Francois Macanda, mentor of the Haitian Brotherhood. It should be nearby, Captain. There, Captain! An English vessel, and she looks to be in trouble. That's fine indeed. Perhaps we should aid her journey to the bottom of the sea. Now let's not be too hasty. She's full of crown cargo. Take a look through your spyglass and see for yourself. Pretty sight. I say this is a good day to lighten King George's pockets. Be careful. A few shots should be enough to cripple her. Too much damage and she'll go down with all souls. And all spoils. We can board and loot her before the crew knows what hit them. Lose 
and catch the wind. Brace for impact. Get them aloft. Down on sail. Trim the yards off the wind. Anchor away. <laughs> this is not coming in for us. Do not play ducks and drakes with that. Let out some sail. Lose the mains. Half sail. Short no sail. Anchor. Captain has the helm. Fire! You have your orders! Awaiting orders, sir! More ship incoming, Captain! Schooner! British vessels! Ready here! You'll founder the ship, Captain! Don't want to sink her. Now's the time. Let's board her. Stun short and sail. Get off the squall. Reef the mains. Clue up gallants. Clue up. Clue up. Clues down. Catch Roll some wind. Let loose the mains. Shake every sail. The icy drink. Man, you see? Let out some sail! Show them what's for, Captain. Come on, men. The spires are ours. For the moor again! Between here and Anticostia is rough, Captain. We should strengthen the market before going any further. There's a harbour master station nearby. We can spend our new wealth and improvements. Oh, I didn't realize there was a brotherhood in Haiti. Yes, Fosson McCandle is their mentor. He has as many of his assassins from the maroons. Those are escaped slaves and their children, right? They are. It's a shame, though. They escaped terrible conditions only to be killed in an earthquake. But Haiti is a French colony now. Oh, it is. And here, the assassins are helping King Louis. But in Haiti, the French are the slaves who are set free by the assassins. Our struggle is beyond political borders, Shay. Anticosti shouldn't be far. Keep us on course, Captain. Loose all that trip sharp to the wind. There's tops on skeleton royals. Anyone for a cold tumbler, bro? There's Perse, Shay. Small fishing village. This is the place. It's nothing but fishermen in their gear. Aye, right. Perse and fishing go hand in hand. We must serve our purpose well enough. The French fish these waters first, but King George is laying claim to more every year. The locals are caught in the middle. He's off the wind. Go on, I'll say. What do you be needing today?
My thanks for your trust, Captain. Captain has the wheel. Give me some speed. Lay aloft to lose the mains. Anyone for a cold tumbler of rum? And you ship? For sale! All sail! He's off the way! No match for us, Captain! Come to anchor! Loose and catch the wind! Keep the weather eye open! Have you checked? Studs out! Let's get moving! Pull off, lads! Loose the royals! The foe patrols these waters closely, Captain. Enemy ships! They're sinking the fishing boats. You must believe those fishermen strayed into their waters. These cowards must pay. And would you look at that? Standing right in our way, hand to us. What say you? We sink every last one of them. For once, I find myself agreeing with you, Shay. Stranger things have happened. Spread our wings to the wind! Loose tops and royals. Right them down together, fire. Ah! Get Ready the here, fire. Incoming ship. Not friendly. Schooner, sir. They're ready here. They hit us, sir. Back up. Too far from Anticosti Island now. Will your friend the spy be waiting for us? Yes. I hope Le Chasseur has more information about the manuscript. 
Maybe he'll have the whole thing figured out for us. And maybe I'm Emperor of Rome. Obvious, Caesar. Salt air, open skies. A man out on the ocean is as free as a man can be. What do you say, Liam? We're out here for a reason, Shay. Mind your duty. Well, what's the point of freedom if you cannot breathe deep and enjoy it? The temple is thick with his content like a tar. Don't feel liberated until we pry them off. Seems to me we should just talk to them like men instead of skulking around. And would you smile and wish them a good day as they lay their boot on your neck? Of course not. There's the men. They're murdering bastards who want to control the world and everyone in it. Never forget. And we have nothing in common with that, of course. Fine! Yeah! All hands ahoy! Stations! Top gallant royal studs! Fire! Ready to fire, sir! Ha <laughs> ha! They're no match for us! Careful! It's quite a rough squall, cap. Trim sharp to the wind. Loose tops and royals. That wind's trouble, Captain Cormac. We're still leak. Douse the royals and tops. Anchor away. Captain, Captain get the mainsails into the wind. Can't be far now, Captain. Dock the ship here, Captain. We've arrived at Anticosti Island. Go on ahead, Shay. We will meet you at the fort. The wrong here is terrible. Let me see. So, Louis Joseph. First rate. Take a look at this. I borrow these plans from a Royal Navy ship of the line. They are like nothing I have ever seen. Good. We could use some more powerful weapons. Le Chasseur, allow me to present our associate, Shea Cormac. Gentlemen, I have news. On this same ship, I spied the manuscript you seek. 
It was written in an exotic language I did not recognize and was full of drawings, plants, and animals out of an opium dream. But were there no charts, no, no, no maps? No. There may have been some kind of code, but neither I nor the roast beefs could get Where is the manuscript now? The man who brought it said a man named Washington sent him. I know that name. He's an important Templar, isn't he? He is. Lawrence Washington has great ambitions that Templars have helped fulfill. Shay, let's return and find him. You, sir, have our thanks. What's our next hand? Where is Lawrence Washington, Dr. Zars? Jacob, you're finally getting into the spirit of things. He's a Templar and a politician. What's it like? Good. Boy, Stanker. Look, she's all a splat on the roof. Lie them down together fast. and royals. Templars desire to understand the nature of these artifacts. Their spies have called upon many doctors and other learned people in New York. They have also approached many tribes with questions. Yeah, they've been showing that manuscript far and wide. No one can read the strange writing or understand the images. We do have a name, though. We learned that Lawrence Washington sent out the manuscript. Lawrence Washington, businessman, Virginian politician, and high-ranking Templar. Ah, uh, yes. I recently heard he was back from the West Indies. One of my men saw his major domo pick up a strange package. Then that package will be delivered to him promptly. Shay, figure out what it is and find Washington. And when you do, learn all you can. I'll prepare the Morrigan. Hurrah! 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 
Well, if we've any luck, that ship will lead us right to him. I make my own luck, Liam. And Washington is running out of his. We're getting close, Shay. Aye. There she is. All right, man. Time to be quiet. Lawrence Washington is a powerful businessman, a slave owner, and a leading Templar. We lost track of him about a year ago. I recently learned he was in Barbados, but I haven't been able to confirm that. Now. Now you think he had something to do with the theft of the artifacts, don't you? I wouldn't put it past him. Haiti's a short voyage from Barbados, and his return to the colony certainly coincides with the arrival of the artifacts. We cannot let the Templars get control of these colonies. Whatever happens, Lawrence Washington must not survive. I'll make sure he doesn't. Be careful, Captain! Heading for us, sir! Convoy, Captain! British you, vessels! They're all alone, sir! Free for the time. Blockade, Captain! Oh, this won't do. Shay, you must follow that ship on land. I'll do that. Bring the Morrigan around another way. I can track that package and find Washington. That's all but made! Sub blockade. And remember what I said, Shay. Washington must die. this a rifle you there stay where you are how can that be it makes no sound it's 
for the present. Buster Washington. It's a strange surprise. Not quite what I was expecting. Now I must find Washington on interrogation. Oh, no. Right on the boat. Hey, how are the boats? You? You're funny, get your life. Why do you think you're going? Stop here. I'll come to that. Invitation. Splendid party, wouldn't you say? Indeed. Hold on now! Perhaps he's not running. You could be playing the mouse here. Yeah? I'll have I yet! How goes your sugar plantation? Terrible. Measles broke up last month. Twenty laborers dead so far. I'm sorry to hear that. Thank you. I've mortgaged everything to bring a new hands from Downing. Hopefully these will be more resistant. Keep your brown pass on your shoulder while you march. It's the most reliable firearm ever created. Get your best friend when trouble has attacked. I need to get to Washington first, then I'll worry about the artifacts. Some special about his policy. You mean a rich man? Politics, huh? Stop there! Brother, 
Are you sure you shouldn't be in bed? I am fine, George. Be a good host for my sake. Go to the wine cellar and get something special for our guests. I will. Gentlemen. <coughs> my brother is a bright spot in a troubled land. If I may make one request before I depart this life, please leave him in peace. He should have nothing to do with the troubles of the Templar cause. We all respect that sentiment, sir. You have my thanks, gentlemen. Master Smith, are you ready to leave on your voyage? Aye, sir. I shall return with answers. Master Wardrop, are you likewise engaged with the manuscript? Yes, sir. We will soon know its meaning. Then I bid you take your leave. <laughs> <laughs> uh, uh. Master can barely stand on his own two feet. I have to be right about him, Liam. Because I'm about to murder a dying man. to ruin Templar plans, Master Washington. <coughs> but my plans are already in motion. Even leading you here <coughs> has given my allies time to escape. <coughs> Thank you for making my end a quick one. And thank you for revealing your master plan, you scheming snake. God damn it. I'd better hurry. I have to get to the Morgan. Liam, I hope you brought the ship around. Corner it. Is that a ship, Mortar? That's not Spartan. Quick! He is not getting through! What are you rolling about on the ground for? Out of the way! Is that a ship, Mortar? That's not sporting! Out of the way! You've got him inside the house! Clear the way! Out of the way! We'll not be looting him! He's trying to give us a stick! Look at the ship, Captain! Give me some speed! Fire! They want you to hit, sir! He's off the wind! More sail! All sail! Fill the sails! They're firing, sir! Fire. Fire. Lawrence Washington is dead. You look disappointed. The sickly way that man looked. He would have been dead in a month anyway. And two other Templars got away. They're looking into the manuscript and box. Did they have the artifacts? 
I don't know. Perhaps. I can't be sure. Then you did what was right by the Brotherhood. You'll find the object later. Cheer up, Shay. It's a rare day we can sow such chaos among the Templars. Perhaps. But to hear Washington speak, it didn't sound like they'd be too put out by the loss. Well, that's what he'd want you to think. That's it for part one. As always, the thank you. Please remember, to, remember to like, share, and subscribe as passed? always. So far, it's been fun. I'm really enjoying playing Shay and just watching, just getting a sense of Assassin's Creed. So I may actually end up playing another one. We'll see. Anyway, again, thank you, and I will see you next week.